A cold snap covers the state. Bitter cold weather causes pain. A nasty winter and full of super frost. soakers are great in the summer. See how they and other household items fare during a cold snap. Next. Well, it is rarely too cold for hockey. You know, this is Minnesota after all. But it is too cold for some everyday items to behave normally. WCCO's John Lordson joins us now from Lake Nokomis in Minneapolis to show us some ice cold experiments. Hi, John. Well, it's been an experiment itself, Amelia. How you doing out there? Yeah, it's been an experiment itself to see all these hockey players handle this frigid cold. And they're clearing off the ice right now, getting ready for hockey to begin again at 530. They've been having fun for the most part all day long. And so were a group of students from Hope Academy in Minneapolis as they made water do some very unusual things things in the frigid weather. All right, we got a couple of other ones. Uh, one of them is throwing some hot water. This group of eighth graders is about to prove that it is possible to have fun in sub-zero temperatures. In fact, this weather is downright cool. They, they think it's fun. It's, it's kind of a fun way to, to connect with the kids and, and uh, yeah, have fun like that. Nathan Ziegler is the upper school principal for Hope Academy in Minneapolis. Today, he's got a super soaker filled with hot water, a bottle of bubbles, and some bananas suffering from severe frostbite to prove that a lot of science comes with frigid temperatures. The bananas, I wasn't expecting them to be really hard. I thought they were going to break right away, but it worked. The bananas sat outside all night. The bubbles didn't need to. They just froze and crystallized when they were caught. And when hot water hit the air, well, you can see the result. There's not one class that I've tried that before. <laughs> this is the most fun I've had in a long time at school. So. Is there any... On that story, Nathan Ziegler has a bunch of these experiments on YouTube. No quiz today, Amelia. Just a chance to get outside and enjoy this weather. If you can, enjoy this weather here back at the U.S. Pond Hockey Tournaments. Again, hockey begins at 530. We'll see how they do tonight. It's going to be pretty cold out here. Yes, it is. All right, John. Thank you. You see right out you there.